case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. USF&G, a large insurance firm, recently found itself on the losing end of a substantial breach of contract lawsuit brought by a smaller insurance agency. A court verdict commanded the firm to pay the plaintiff a total of $844,650 comprised of $809,650 in lost future profits and $35,000 less than the market value when the plaintiff sold their business. USF&G terminated a contractual agreement which had allowed the plaintiff to sell USF&G insurance in exchange for commission. The action pushed the plaintiff into a deeper financial quandary, sparking the contentious lawsuit. USF&G disputed both the jury verdict and the court's instructions for the award citing the lost profits as an impermissible double recovery and claiming insufficient evidence to justify this amount. The United States Court of Appeals for the Tenth Circuit stepped in with a decision that turned the tables in favor of USF and G. Reviewing the case, the court determined that the hefty award for lost profits was, indeed, a case of double recovery, as this figure had already been factored into the fair market value of the business when it was sold. In a clarified decision that curbs the possibility of double recovery, the court changed gears on the award, eliminating the $809,650 award for lost profits. Instead, it approved an alternative $35,000 relief for the decrease in the property's value. This pivotal case sets precedence for future cases involving profit loss and business valuation. The court's intricate analysis and bold decision ensures the principle that double recovery for a single injury is indeed invalid. The case was sent back to the lower court to recalibrate the judgment aligned with this landmark ruling. With this lawsuit, the court emphasizes the idea that lost profits can be awarded as damages, but only if these losses are not already accounted for in other damage calculations. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.